Hello guys, and I am back. I am doing my very first Transformers review. This is the Transformers reviews of Deluxe Class Revenge of the Fallen Skyquake. Very nice jet. I, ve I love them. This is a very nice jet. Very detailed. Skyquake is modeled after the British Harrier. Very good jet. Quite detailed. Let me zoom in. Very detailed. Obviously, you can see these main colors are white and blue. <laughs> you got some undercarriage here, but still, it's a pretty good jet. Better than uh, like the move, very first movie for Voyagers and all that. They were pretty blocky, but still, this is a very nice jet. Despite the fake cockpit, the all this right here. Uh, very nice. He does have some weapons which store right here, but I have no idea where they are. Uh, the landing gear flip, sorry, comes up for the transformation. The cockpit opens, very nice. Now, on to the transformation of this thing. Let me zoom out a little bit. First off, wait, I take the back, let me zoom in. First off you need to do is take the wings right here, fold them down, fold them down. Then, take the intakes, to split his legs apart. Now, you're starting to reveal most of his body. Now, a little, a little zoom out. Now, to the legs, he has a very funky transformation. Now take this wing right here and leave it just like that for a while. Now take the legs and unfold them double with a double hinge joint. Freaky. Now these feet are very weird. Now take the ends of the intakes, now flip them out, turn them off 180 degrees, leave them like that. Now you can f fix the wing right here. Same thing on the other side. Mm. Come on. Come on. Let me pop the leg off. The leg off. Sorry, I can't speak straight for today for some reason. Now, just like I did. Just leave it halfway right now. Unfold it. Now, take the leg. Flip it. Turn it around. And... Take this, flip it down. No, it's wrong. There we go. You got a leg. <laughs> now pop it back in. Pop it back in the joint. Come on. You got some very stiff joints on this thing. And uh, connect the pelvis. Now for the upper body. Let me zoom out. Now. Now the um, basically unlock it. You need to take all the take that cockpit and flip it down. Then dig your fingernail right here. Great, the battery's going dead. This thing uses a lot of battery power. And unfold it just like that. I'm gonna hurry this up. Take this wing. Take the tail. Flip it down. Now take this whole front assembly. Turn it down. Turn it around. Now to lock it into place. Put the cockpit to his chest. Then, here's a here's his mech alive gimmick right here for the transformation. When you spin his le his arm up, his little wheel spins. Pretty nice. I like it. Take these two panels, clip them in right here. Uh oh. Cat fight. Same thing around here. Now take it up. Flip it just like that. Then, take the cockpit, open it, and fold his arm down. There we go. Nice. Now, gotta zoom in. Take the, take the top of the head, and unsplit it. Then turn around, then come right here, and just push it right up. Zoom in, 
Then take the here's two tab. Here's two tabs right here. Oh wait. First, I forgot. I skipped a step. First, take the torso and flip it down. Sorry about that. I am not a redneck. Now just tab the tab this into his back. Do a little zooming. And there we have, let me adjust the camera, Revenge of the Fallen, if I can just get them to stand up straight, Skyquake. Very nice, very detailed. I love his detailing. Come on. Quite detailed. Very nice. I wish I could have folded these in, but still, it's very nice. Make a lot of gimmick. This little wheel is spinning. Pretty nice. That's one of the ni that's one of the nicer ones right there. Some of them just stupid. Oh sh I wish I had uh the monitor out so I can show you. Now in terms of articulation, his head what goes side to side. His arms full three sixty with the mech alive. Uh full three sixty at his upper arm, bent at the elbow. And on this side, you can't really do much, but it does make up that would give him a bit of a wrist. He does have waist articulation, but you have to unlock all this stuff right here. That's really that's one of the flaws to, the, to this guy. Do a little. Now, with the legs, they're on a ball joint, so they go every which way. Full 360 at the upper thigh, <clears throat> and t bends two places at the knee due to the transformation. And then his ankles go side to side, in and out, in a full 360. Very well articulated. <clears throat> That's basically it for him. He does have weapons, but I have no idea where they are. And, uh... Jet mode, they store underneath the rings. While in rut mode, for battle mode, one sits right here and one sits right here instead of on his hands. Stupid fly, go away. He's pretty poseable. Come on. My flip is new, so sorry about all the zooming. Come on. Come on. I guess you can take the wings like that. Makes them more, makes them better. If I can just get them to pose. That's a very nice pose. I have to hold them up though. Sorry about that. And there we have. My very first Transformer review of ROTF Skyquake. Very nice figure. I recommend it. Ciao.